Hey there again folks, welcome back to my random gaming series. Today we're playing Metalborg. Uh, City of Mages is the subtitle that's on Steam, it's not on here. This is early access so that might be added in the in the uh, full release. Uh, and I would like to thank uh, the folks at over at Armature Games for letting me try this game out for free. Um, it's supposed to be some, uh, like some, uh, strategy type game, I believe, from the little bit that I looked at it. Uh, so yeah, let's, uh, let's, let's give it a try. It looks like it might be a bit involved, just from like the few screenshots that I saw. Uh, new game. I will say one thing. Settings is pretty bare bones. And I don't like just when you click randomly, it makes weird, it makes noises. It was pretty loud when I first started. I turned it down by like, uh, it was 100%. This is it at like 24. So, yeah, new game. Alpha. The universe has no end, but has a beginning. It spins around Mittelborg, a world between worlds. The so click. Okay, I do. It is a city of mages that govern equilibrium in the world, and they are ruled by a great chancellor. Cool. I'm glad he's a great chancellor. It would suck if he's a crappy chancellor. Chancellor's task to watch Ove, the world tree. If it does, everything will perish. And now it is dying. I'm assuming that instead of does, it means dies. If it dies, everything will perish. I think is what's what they're meaning. Uh, because the throne is empty, Middleborg needs a new chancellor. And so it happens, the world tree has chosen you. Sweet. Oh, we get a crown. Nice. Oh, I ha oh we clicked the clown. Oh, crown. Oh, got to click it a few times. That's weird. Uh, <clears throat> if you leave the game before the end of the tutorial, it will break the current profile. We will fix it soon. Okay. This is uh, this came out on the 29th in early access. So, uh, so okay. That was about three days ago. So we were waiting for you, Chancellor. Magical tempests, a badly battered. Magical Tempest, badly battered Middleborg. Oh my gosh, that's like a seems like a like a t tongue twister right there. But it is in your power to restore the former greatness of the city. Let's start with protection. Whoa. Wait, shouldn't we get by dinner first? Uh, this quarter is called Aegis. Once it was a symbol of the magical power of the city, but now there is just a tower of light here. Let's take a closer look at it. Say, okay, so click on it. Okay. The Tower of Light supports the magical barrier. Barrier. Rebuild it in the bar in the barrages of witching wind that won't do you no harm. Oh my word, this is this is gonna be a lot of tongue twisters for sure. So, um, while the flame of order is burning on its top middle board, stands keep it encandled. Uh, more mages, more effective. Effective the district. Okay. Got repaired. Okay. <clears throat> as for uh, as for the protection from swords and arrows, um, that was a that was a hard sentence to say. I'm not sure if it's that well put together. Um, anyway, there is a garrison here. The city guard live. Tough and fearless folks. Fearless. Nice. Make sure that the garrison has he healthy fighters, and the city will be reliably protected from enemy raids. Okay, so we're repairing stuff. I guess that's what the new boss had to do. We have to go back and uh, see what the old boss tore, uh, you know, let let go, you know. Your main resource is ether, or ether. I'm not sure, what is it ether? Because I know in like the Final Fantasy games, there's ethers, uh, but I don't, I don't remember having A's in them. 
I know they weren't written with A's. Anyway, as you can see, we have almost none left. But fortunately, we know how to get more of it. Is that it? Yeah, only one. That that's that's not many. Uh, Adventum is the trading quarter of Middleborg, and this is where the Wind Catcher stands, your main source of ether. Uh, absorbs the essence of ether from magical tempests. The longer storm is, the more essence the Wind Catcher takes in. Okay. So the longer the storm is, yeah. So we're hoping for bad weather. Come on, tornadoes! Come on down! Just like the price is right. Um, extracts ether from the magical winds. The stronger the tempest, the more ether there is to extract. Produces 50 a day. So, a major serve at the wind catcher, and the more of them there are, the more ether you can get. Sweet. So, you, we're getting 55 a day. How many are we add? Is it the. Uh, we have one more we can do? Oh, no, no, okay. <clears throat> In general, magicians are your best helpers. You can send them to any quarter and they will improve its work. Okay. We latch ether to. We. Oh, we lack ether. Yeah. I need some, uh, need some proofreading. Uh, this game from the, uh, uh, from the developer name and the publisher, too, I'm saying. Uh, Am Armature Games and Asterin Games may not be uh, uh, English uh, native English speakers. I can't say anything. I'm I'm a native English speaker, and I can't speak very well, but uh, definitely need some proofreading, I believe. Unless unless I'm missing, uh, missing some meaning, but I think that says, We lack either to restore the strength of the garrison. Well, you have to use magicians. One mage is worth many warriors. Send the mage to the garrison to strengthen it. Okay. Although, I think, you know, some of the way that it's written, while confusing, um, does kind of add maybe an old-timey type feel to it. Maybe. Like some, some of them, anyway. So that I kind of like. Um... Okay, anyway, let's add a mage. The prophecies did not last, sire. You are indeed a quick learner. Glory to the new chancellor. Yeah. I really learned all that stuff. Totally wasn't taught it. Well, totally wasn't walked through it completely. Now you're ready for the Tempest. So there's a Tempest at the end of every day. Is that the way it works? During the Tempest, your city will face many dangers. Oh my. One of them is the Barrage, a stream of dark energy sweeping away everything in its path. Okay, thick clouds filled with evil might surrounded the city, and lilac lightnings drew runes in the skies. Roaring waves of ether caused a lot of damage, but the city stood this time. Hmm. So, yeah, continue. Oh, continue here, I guess. The branch has caused damage to your barrier, but the tree did not suffer. You remember what the tree means to us? Yeah, if it dies, everything does. So it sounds like... Hmm. Sounds like... You have to, I get, like, you have to put this area in risk in order to, yeah. Like, it seems like this Tempest is what provides power to keep from dying from the Tempest. Is that right? Uh, yeah, I remember what it means to, oh, ooh. Portal is closed. Oh, Let's, okay, we'll read this first. City guards repelled the raid, but the garrison had a hard time. If the enemy breaks through, the damage will be inflicted on the tree, and we won't be able to restore it even with the help of the force. What? There's the force? Da, 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 da. <laughs> 
Is that is that what we got here? I don't know why I was doing hand motions. My webcam didn't know, but I was like, I was thinking like in uh, when uh, Luke is hung up uh, upside down in the uh, the ice cave in the. I almost said bad, but that's not bad. The, the snow, the snow creature. Uh, they got names, don't they? Tauntauns are the things that they ride on at that Han stuff Luke in to keep them warm. What is the? I think the snow creature has a name, but I can't remember what the name is. You know, he's the he's the guy that uh, you know it's, he's the one that loses an arm. A lot of people lose arms in Star Wars. <laughs> they need to be better armed in Star Wars. Uh, every day the Tempest, yeah, this is, Star Wars is not in, uh, well, it, it did say the Force, so, I mean, it almost feels like <laughs> they want it to be involved in Star Wars. I'm, I'm sure they don't. Um, the Force might be another, since this is, uh, uh, uh translated from another language, it might be, uh, a translation that a word in whatever language this is this was originally in might be direct the direct translation of that might be the force <laughs> uh, which would make which could make sense because you know I remember Star Wars uh, you know, it has a lot of uh, sprinkling of different little mythology bits so that might be where the force came from is uh, whatever legend that this is based off of can't remember. I'm not as up to. Uh, I'm not as hip with the Star Wars knowledge as I was back about 10, 15 years ago. Um. Anyway, anyway every day of the Tempest, your wind catcher gathers ether. You can use it after the end of the Tempest. Okay. Portals closed. The smell of blood and smoke floats above the sea. The attack was unexpected. Middleborg stood, but not every soul lived to see that day. The living mourned the dead. It'd be awkward if dead mourned the living. It would be. It would be rather bad. Incoming 33 physical damage, resisted 4 damage. Okay, so the garrison guards took 29 damage. Okay. So I'm guessing if, uh, yeah, I said that whatever damage, uh, that the raid succeeds, damage would be done on tree. So I guess, okay. I think I'm trying to do math, and I was like, nah, I shouldn't do it. Oh, I have a storm. What? If it is not luck, the lull is here. On this day, nothing threatens the city. Wait, how many days are we going through here? So, okay, are each, each of these days? Hmm. Peace and silence lay above the middle world. Is it, is it a calm before the storm or the long-expected peace? Main thing, Middleborg may rest now. Huh. Okay. It was not easy, but the city survived. You survived your first tempest. Now you're ready to take control. Oh my, we are in control now. Oh dear. What do I do? I don't know what I do here. Um... Source of magical barrier around the city protecting it from tempest. And it is twenty-five, correct? It's got a it's got a dash there, so I'm guessing it's not negative twenty-five, but it's got it's twenty-five power, and since it's halfway I'm guessing maximum is fit. We need more guards though. It looks like. Um we got eighty one ether. I, I mean, 181 ether. So. Oh, and we can level up, too. For 50. You can determine your future plans and think about your fate. Be reborn. Hmm. Yeah, I, I did see that on the... Uh, in this in the steam description it says something about this having rogue like elements so uh, huh after you die I guess you restart or something um, okay let's uh, 
Dead Siders on the beginning. Once your spirit leaves your leaves the body, you'll be seeing a bright light. Stay away from it. Head for the darkness. And we'll meet again. What? 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 I don't know if I should trust somebody saying, don't go to the light. Um, I don't want to go the other direction. Okay, there's achievements. Okay, I don't think this game has Steam achievements. Nah, I don't have Steam achievements. That might be something that's in uh, going to be uh, in the full release. Because, yeah, like I said, the game is in early access. Hmm. I just glanced over at the Steam page and it's... Uh, this is uh, on sale right now for $13.49. Regular price, $15. Okay. It's nice having a second monitor in file. Back when I was doing YouTube uh, uh, last year, you know, and well, before now, I, I never had the second monitor. I, and I have a much better computer now. So it's. The convenience of the second monitor is very, very lovely. I can be a little bit more informed than uh, than I used to. Huh, what should we... Re the guard seems like it's the most important. We can level it up, so I get... I say we repair. Well, here's the thing. Will leveling up repair it automatically? Portal allows you to send mages into expeditions. They will return after the end of the next tempest and bring trophies with them. Oh. Okay, so it did upgrade. I, I, I'll drop that. Okay. Oh. Sound effect. Oh. I got you. I got you. I was like, why did it suddenly skip from that to that? Okay, this is in the same uh, thing as the garrison. Gotcha, gotcha. By updating the garrison, I unlock this. Scouting in the anthrax. Okay. <laughs> and that did not repair it. Okay. Walk in the long bogs. Road to the Itis. Scouting in the ro robo. Scouting in the green fields. All these are easy, so, I mean, oh, okay, so this is telling me what all I can get. don't know what any of this stuff really does, so, I mean, once I play it, I'll know better what I would want to do. So, sheltered world's practically safe, but with few finds. Okay, let's just do this one. Wait, what? How did I do it? How do I do it? Do I need to unassign this mage? And then... Okay, gotcha. I have to unassign, then do it. Okay. So, yeah, I didn't... Okay, so, good. I can still repair it. Good. Okay. I don't know what the X does. Okay, good. That's what I hoped it did. I can oh I can repair it for free nice oh never mind I can't repair it at all oh okay that's weird okay hmm that just closes it out okay. That inventory. That tells us what, uh, what, uh, what our mages are doing. 
Guess we end the day now? What does that do? It does nothing. Okay. So at the end of each day, we have to go through this. Thick clouds fill, filled with evil minds. So that hurt the barrier. Okay. Garrison guards got beat down a little bit. And peace again. Okay. Potion can be consumed before the tempest begins. Their effect will last the whole tempest and, and can save your life. Heals the city guards every day of the tempest by 5%. Okay. Seems like a good thing to do. We've got 180 now. Hmm. So I think we need to repair. Why can't we repair? Let's repair the barrier for sure. Why can't we repair? Oh! What? Okay. Okay, well that's... Okay, I get, I, I get it now. Okay. So ether is important. How do we get more mages? That's something I'm not sure about. Okay, let's upgrade this, and that will hopefully get us more ether. You can buy you can buy potions, scrolls, and even artifacts on the market. Improve the quarter to open up new goods for a fee. Their list can be updated. Okay, Living Tar heals the world tree every day of the Tempest by 3%. Okay. So let's let's send this guy back into the into the thing. Um We can't do it again right now. Where, where did our mage go? Oh, none of them was assigned. What? Wait, what? Oh, he's already... Oh, he's still in the portal? How long does he stay in the portal? Um, I mean, we should go ahead and use this, I guess. Because the city guards are taking a beating. That would be a good idea. That'll, that'll make me have to pay less. Okay. So I guess we're in the day again. We'll, we'll try to upgrade that one next time. Hopefully we don't die. Okay. Ooh. That was more. That was more damage than uh, than before. Oh. Ooh. Crap. The world tree took some damage. Okay. Random bonus at the end of the cycle. Okay. Well, the guards did heal up some. So that is good. Prepare that for 88. Prepare that for 76. And crap, we don't have any... They really didn't bring in more ether. I was thinking maybe that would increase the bonus or, th or the max. And also, you know, boost how much we get in each time. Hmm. I guess we need to keep using these. Um, I think the effect from the... Oh, now, now, oh, now the guy is done at the portal. Um... Huh. Let's add a mage. Cause that was that was pretty rough that time. Okay. Okay. That wasn't as bad as last time. Oh 
A dying dimension sends a call for help. They know they know where we are, we are here and receiving. They are they are many, more than ten hundred women and children. Should we take them in? Um, take them all? I don't know. We open the gates and look out the win look out the window. The city the city is under nine inches of ice and snow. We are sending everyone to fix it. People are saved. Time is lost. Legio district is damaged. Is that because I took in people? Oh, drink. Drink drunk. It's absolutely unacceptable, sire. Three of my best men, officers of Middleborg, are drinking heavily and on a regular basis. They are frequenting the tavern, missing duties, or attending them stoned. They will spoil the guard, and I suggest we deal with them in the, with the strictest punishment. Um. Huh. Okay, choosing this option, we'll use scroll voice of steel. We don't have one, though. So I guess we can. Okay, yeah. Hmm. Introduce prohibition. That sure didn't work in America way back when. Um, lash them? It seems... It seems incredibly harsh. Degrade them. Lashes are good to teach one, but are bad at motivating the rest. Mor morale is low, and the training ceases until these drunkards get back on their feet. Even if absenta... This booze has long. No, no, what they mean. This booze has long-lasting side effects. Physical resistance decreased by ten percent. Okay, so it lasts three days each time. Okay, so we only lost guards that time. The barrier didn't get hit, so let's upgrade the barrier. In the, in the laboratory, you can mix potions and later artifacts. At first, the process will be unpredictable, but later you may discover more reliable how about uh, expensive methods. Okay. Hmm. How do we get more mages? We don't have any potions right now, so... Do we? No, we don't. Hmm. And the portal's gone. Wait. Wait, the portal's gone? Wait, what? Wait, so the, those are temporary? Then what's the point of leveling up? Surely it's not actually temporary. Okay. It's not the same. It was the same every, uh, the first two times. Okay, now it's different. Okay, so we got peace. Hmm, the Shaky Tavern. Sire, some strange folk came to the tavern today. They look like assassins. I'd like to wiggle it in their favor, but how? I need your advice. Well, we would be kind of hypocritical if we, uh, <laughs> if we did that. Um, I don't know what roll the dice means. So if we have... So I guess we can get scrolls. And those would probably be the more favorable outcomes to bribe the guards. I'm guessing is is what that's saying. I don't know what it means by roll the dice. How good of assassins are they? Are they? We don't know for sure if they're assassins. 
Yeah, we actually don't know if they're assassins. Let's find the champion to find out if they're assassins. I won, sir. I'm a good old lead. Lead dice helped me again. They left town. Too popular to stay now. And I got this pure might. Oh, I got, and I got this pure might. Of course, it is all yours. So, yes, a, good, a new mage. Awesome. Sire, one of Middleborg's artifacts is worrying me lately. It is the Living Tongue. Ew. Yes, the one that came straight from the demon's mouth, so it is told. That tongue is quite lively lately. And forgive me, but it is trying to escape from the hall, shall we? What shall we do, sire? Um... Why are we keeping it? Is this is this is this tongue beneficial? I wish I knew the benefits of it. If we had a thing, we could return it, burn it. Scrolls contain the wisdom uh, of generations. They will be useful to you in the events. If you run into a problem, then the scroll can reveal the safest and most profitable solution to it. Okay. The tongue. You're right, sire. All we had to do was wait. I said burn it! What the crap? I said burn it! I was fixing to say the last one didn't seem like it... He said something about roll the dice. And, uh... When I clicked on fight the champion, so I was like, I was thinking, okay, maybe we were rolling the dice was fighting the champion. It was a gamble to fight the champion. So, but yeah, this what? 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 The tongue, you're right, sire. All we had to do was wait. Unrest is over, and the tongue is calm and dead again. But it's also not the pull of saline, which is, as the alchemists say. A really powerful potion you have acquired a scroll. Fool's riddle. Okay, so it's not doing what I say it, what I'm telling it to do. I mean, these are good options. Beneficial, but still not telling me, it's still not doing what I tell it to do. It's weird. Why is it doing that? So we got a scroll. We got two scrolls. Okay, so let, I guess we could mess with the laboratory now. Oh, it's, a, it's only, yeah, it's only good for potions, okay. Hmm, so we didn't actually take any damage. The garrison seems really important, so let's... Oh, I need to restore it, ooh. Ooh, and I need to, I need to send a... Send a mage in through the portal. Okay, so I guess... Send the mage in there. Hmm. Okay, well, I guess we're not going to worry about that then. Uh, let's send this. We'll make the barrier more effective. Um, let's upgrade this. Okay, okay, so now we have more guards. Okay, that's kind of what I figured would happen. So 150 and 150 for that, right? Yeah. So I guess we probably should upgrade that next. That way. I'm really confused about that. I don't know why. That That's... Uh, Okay, no problem on the first day. While rebuilding the Hall of Fame, we found a sealed entrance to, the, to an ancient crypt. Enter in fear, refuse in regret. It's written on the door, and quiet footsteps can be heard behind it. Should we open it, my lord?
Hmm. Let's say this. So we need a memory of the earth to do that. Cast a killing spell. So we will know for sure. So my 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 mouse cursor is definitely on this one. Uh, we enter the crypt and the skeleton rushes towards us, but instead of biting or kicking, he bows and gives us this scroll. Here, sire, I brought. I brought it right away. It didn't say anything about casting this the kill spell. Okay. Cool. We got a scroll. In peace. Okay. So if I level up, this will probably get us more ether each time. Correct. Although we really don't have and boost the max amount, did it? Okay. Well, I don't want us to not get uh be able to get the ether that we get. It'll go probably go over our max, so probably be good to get this. Chronicles of the Roamer. Okay. Well, I can upgrade that one for another 200. Is that how much these are? Yeah, for another 200. Okay, so it's 150 than 200. Okay. Hmm. This has an interesting idea to it. Oh, dang! I'm gonna have to repair after this one. The Summoner. A new challenge for you, Chancellor. An old man came in today. He claims to know the summoning spell. He says he can summon a blessing from Dole, the god of honesty, in exchange for a single scroll from the hall. Any scroll, what do you think? Mm, I don't have any... Wait, am I supposed to see? Okay, just wondering. Nope, um... The, uh... I was wondering maybe if I'm supposed to select these with, uh... The uh, arrow keys? But no. We don't have any scrolly wishes. His eyes went red when he saw the scrolls. I tried to stop him, but he moved so fast. Uh, and fought with the guards and with the rage of a bear. We lost the scroll, I'm afraid, and the blessing as well. What? Oh man. Oh dang, the world trees received 66 damage. Ooh. Portal's closed. The smell of blood and smoke floats above the city. The attack was unexpected. Middleborg stood. But okay. Okay. We're not gonna repair. Um, uh, I'm, I'm about, I'm about done with this game for now, but I do want to see what happens when you lose. So we're not going to repair. We will upgrade. We'll, we will upgrade this, see what happens. Okay, we did hit maximum. The crystal retort increases the ether limit you can restore. That you can store. So, gotcha. I should say, that should happen, you know. Okay. Cool. See, we're probably gonna lose here. Yep. Death, sir, is only the beginning. Once your spirit leaves the, leaves the body, you'll be seeing a bright, a bright light. Stay away from it. Head... For the darkness, and we will meet again. Can you hear me, sire? You are dead still, but soon you will be back. However, we may use this time we have wisely. Where would you like to send your soul to wander and observe? A short, unnoticed visit to the past, future, or the present. Okay, um, seriously though. Seems like step go like. Not going to the light is a bad decision if uh, if this is what we're saying. I mean, uh, has this 
charms, you know, a couple of them, but uh, probably not good though. <laughs> um, does the present, past, or the future? What does this mean? I don't know what this means. Do we see the future? Sir, you've been talking in your sleep. You've been away for too long and call, and all the time vision stormed your brain. The future was. The future it was darkness. That is the only word you said distinctively and loud. You screamed it in fact. You're dead, but not gone. But skin and bones decay while the spirit lives on. The tree summons you back to Middleborg. Sir, the struggle continues. So we learned. So that was an achievement we got. Huh. Journal. So what does this... Hmm. So does this unlock a, things that will make it a stronger in the future so that future runs can... seems like so I'm guessing that getting the achievements will also help things also so getting scrolls is good um, hmm okay okay well that's it for this one um I like the idea of the game. I think this game can be really cool. Okay, okay, I see Alpha down here. Somehow I missed Alpha. Actually, I saw that earlier, but I think I thought it was part of the loading uh, bar. Somehow I missed it, I think, on the main menu, though. Um, but, uh, yeah, well, it's an Alpha anyway. Um, definitely seems like it's not working completely right, though. It was not, I was not able to select the ones I wanted to select. Um, I couldn't tell exactly about that last one, but, um, what was it? Uh, I wanted to cast a death spell on the chamber. It didn't even reference a death spell. It said, you go in and the skeleton, instead of attacking you, gives you the thing, you know, which is a favorable outcome, but I mean, yeah. I don't, I don't quite understand that. You know, I said, cast the killing spell, you know. So, it should let me do what I want to do? And that last one was actually a negative outcome. So, in that, in, in that instance, what I picked could have been the right thing to, to do. So, yeah, that, that part is a little bit janky. I don't know, I don't know what the problem is with it, whether or not it's not programmed, per, well, I'm assuming it's not programmed correctly, but I don't know if the buttons are are not programmed right, or if somehow the buttons you hit the wrong one. I'm not sure. That's that right there, there. You know, was like, you know, that's that's the decision making part. You know, um, so yeah, um. The aesthetic is pretty good on the game. I, I like it pretty well. And I mean, I like and I like the the basic idea of it. But yeah, the, those events. If it, if it doesn't let me, if it doesn't let me pick the events that I want to do, that that does kind of make me a little bit unhappy. Uh, you know, even if I fail them, I would like to fail them of my own accord. I'm used to failing a lot in games in real life too. So you know. I'm used to it. I can take it. <laughs> um, but yeah. And uh, yeah, I, I, I like. I think the game has promise. Hopefully, hopefully it's gonna keep being worked on, and it could be maybe it'll be something good. I do think it maybe came out a little bit earlier than it should have. Uh, maybe once it got into the beta stage rather than the alpha stage. But uh, but yeah. Oh, and the. Uh, Proofreading definitely needs some proofreading. I saw some stuff wrong in it, like uh, I saw skies spelled S K Y 
E S, I think is how I. S the skies are spelled S K I E S. Unless maybe it's um uh, maybe there's a uh, you know in some countries maybe that is the proper way to spell it. You know, kind of like uh, uh British. You know, uh, British and you know America uh, spells things uh different. I say British like it's a country. I know British is not a country. Britain is a country. But in British writing, things are spelled different. Like color is C O L O U R rather than you know, we drop the uh, we drop the U. We we just got to say uh C O L O R. So I don't know if that might be something that's uh perhaps not a uh, grammatical error. But it felt that way, you know. But uh, the writing, you know, was maybe a little confusing, but, you know, maybe it was meant, maybe, maybe they were going for the kind of the Yoda type, uh, you know, speak, you know, which with it being like fantasy type, you know, that, that could make sense. That could make sense. I, I, I didn't have a problem with it. I think if done consistently where you can still understand what they're saying, uh, that can work, you know. If it, you know, you don't want to just, you know, you don't want it to just be bland and be like, click on this. This repairs the shield. This repairs, or this repairs the barrier. This repairs the soldiers, you know, uh, or the garrison or whatever. So, uh, having it written differently, you know, could add some nice flavor to it. Yeah. But anyway, yeah, it's, it's got, it's got promise. Hopefully they're gonna keep working on it. But anyway, guys, that's it for the that's it for today. Hopefully you enjoyed and uh, oh, and the link will be down in the description below if you want to check the game out for yourself. Like I said, it's fifteen dollars regular price right now. It is uh, you can get it for thirteen forty nine. That it, uh, offer ends on December sixth. Today, today the second. It's probably just gonna be fifteen dollars by the time this video goes up. Unless I decide to put this one out in, uh, after the uh, other game that I recorded. Uh, but anyway, uh, directly after the... But anyway, yeah. Hopefully you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next random game. Later, folks.